Good morning. Hi, my name is Kathleen Broder. I'm a professional artist. I live in Central Florida. Uh, thank you for the diversity of urban art for showcasing me today. I've been in the area for over 25 years. I mostly paint with oil paint. I use a palette knife technique. Um, I graduated from Florida State University and I'm originally from Connecticut, but I've lived in Florida for over 30 years. Um, today I want to talk about my painting. Uh, it has quite a story. Um, I originally um, painted the kimono first and I used a palette knife. About 95% of the painting I use just this small little palette knife to paint with and I get the nice beautiful rich colors with the palette knife. Um, she was showcased in a show at the University of St. Louis and Muse Museum of Art. Um, I did a show there with my husband. It was called Return to Forever and we had over a hundred pieces of art and she was part of that show. And also um, I entered her in another competition. It's called Art and Capital. It's in Paris and it's the uh, old historic French salon. And I entered her and I added the two sections to her. Um, and I wanted, to, this is a, um, also a palette knife technique. And it was interesting trying to add three paintings together after just having one, because I had to make sure the composition worked with the painting. So with this painting, I actually repeated the um, design of her shoulder and I repeated it with this. So the flow of the painting works together nicely. And then right here also, I repeated the technique and the um, design of her neck. So that way, the whole flow of the painting all works together. And I just took this to France in February and I won the award of um, honorable mention. So I was very, very excited about that. I've been participating in that show since um, 2013. And this will be the first time that I won, won an award. So I'm very, very proud of that. Um, a lot of it, it's, it's the technique of with the palette knife and having the texture and being able to create a sense of reality even with the palette knife because mostly the palette knife you see is very loose and texture and but I'm able to create a, a sense of reality with the palette knife um, and even on the skin even this is all palette knife I just blend and um, but I, I think I was able to capture a, a really interesting um, expression when you do a portrait, uh, the expression is very important and every little line can change somebody's expression. So you have to be very, very um, careful when you paint a portrait. So I think that was appealing um, and the colors and just having the three, actual three paintings together and having it work. I think that was, um, they liked the composition very much. I believe that was what appealed to the judges. She actually has three stories, to be honest. It's kind of an interesting. Her first story, this, this model is one of my husband. He's also an artist, Edson Campos. This is one of his photographs of a model that he um, photographed. And we did a show in downtown Orlando at the um, gallery at Avalon Island. And we did a show where I did a painting of her and he did a drawing of her, the same image, and we had it side by side at the show. So that was the first time that um, she was displayed. So she's had three different, different events that she's been part of. So, and I really enjoyed painting the, the kimono, especially with the palette knife. Um, it's, it's not an easy thing to do. Um, you have to mix the colors right on the canvas and um, kind of be very brave. And, and um, I use a little brush, but mostly, mostly the palette knife. And that's how you get the brilliant, rich colors by using the, the knife. And so that was how she origi originated. So she's, I've now I've, painted several paintings of her. She's been a very popular and one of my favorite subjects to paint at the moment. <laughs>